Hey, what is up, guys? Skyrim42 or the S42 or whatever you want to call me, it does not matter. And today I'm bringing you a little bit of carrier team deathmatch. I go 27 and 1 this game. I'm not going to lie, these players weren't the best, but it's still a good gameplay regardless. My class setup for this game mode, or game, is the Remington Long Barrel, Laser, and Speed Reload. My perks are Lightweight, Fast Hands, and Dead Silence, and my kill streaks are UAV, RC Car, and Hunter Killer Drone. The Hunter Killer Drone, I don't know how I feel about it yet, I'm still, I'm st I just started using it, I'm seeing how I feel about it. Anyways, I was going for gold this game, I needed two more Bloodthirsties, and I get one obviously in this game, but I didn't die enough to get another, so... Um, the guns I have gold would be the Remington now, which I have, the DSR, and the MP7. I'm currently going for the, the gold on the crossbow, like as I pull right there. But it's so much harder to get than the Remington, or because the Remington you only need 250 one-shot kills, and the crossbow you need 300 just plain kills. So you'd have to run around only using the crossbow, which is pretty hard to use. So, anyways. This is a new game, so I'm going to tell you about how I think about it, and all that kind of stuff. So, obviously it's harder than the other games. I don't know, they made it harder, I don't know how, but it seems a lot harder than the other games. It's, the connection's pretty good, but actually, no it's not. It's, not. it's awful sometimes, and sometimes it'll be good. But all the Call of Duty's are like that at the start. Um, zombies? At first, I wasn't really, I didn't like what they did with it, I wasn't sure about but once I've realized about transit and how much how fun that is, it made me like it better. But at the start, I did not like it because I thought they just put in town, farm, and then that small map on survival. Because I didn't know what transit was and I didn't play it, but I didn't really like it. But now I do like transit. But I think I like Black Ops Zombies better at the start. But I don't have Nuketown 2025 yet though either. I'm getting the season pass, so I will have that. And speaking of zombies, I will have some live comms. I'm going to be doing some live zombies, and I'm going to be posting it on my channel. I'm going to be uploading them in parts, and I know how. I've got the right stuff and all that stuff. <laughs> the stuff and all that stuff. But anyways, I'm going to be telling you about favorite maps as well. I'll say my three favorite maps are probably this one, and then that ship. Crap, what's it called? Not carrier, but the. Uh, you probably know what I'm talking about. The boat, where it's like a cruise ship or whatever. And. The third. My third favorite map is probably Plaza. I know a lot of people don't really like that map. But I like Plaza. I just. I always do good there. And a lot of people say they don't like it because they don't do there. And it's. I've gotten dogs there before, so. I do pretty good there. My three favorite guns are probably the Remington, the MP7, and the DSR. That's why I have them all gold. My three favorite score streaks are probably the Stealth Chopper, because I really like the Stealth Chopper. It's really good. It reminds me a lot of the Pavlo because it always gets me that a lot of kills. My second favorite score streak is probably probably the. I don't know. Maybe the war machine. I like it on online. On zombies though, it's awful. And my last, my my third favorite score streak is probably the maybe the dogs. I don't know. They're pretty hard to get, and I've gotten a couple of them, but I don't know. I don't know if they're my favorite, but I definitely like getting them. It's like it's like going for a nuke or a Moab is just going for dogs since it's such a high kill streak in this game. Anyways, my thoughts on this game compared to Black Ops 2. I mean, Black Ops 1. When Black Ops 1 first came out, you could tell it was a Treyarch game, but this I'm not sure if you can really tell. Like I can't really tell that much that it's a Treyarch game. And there I just get my Ruthless, but... Yeah, it doesn't seem like a trailer. It seems kind of like a trailer game, and they mixed it with a modern or a act, whatever the Infinity Ward game. And I can I like that though, because it's fast paced for a trailer game, which is good. All the maps are small, and I think, I mean, it's gonna be like every other Call of Duty where somebody finds something and everybody starts hating it, and then they complain like they all do, all the other Call of Duties. But I think on this one, it might last a little bit longer before people. F have that kind of thoughts 
Anyways, this game's getting close to being over. Uh, these people really weren't the best, and I think my I was host too, which helped. But I still had a good game, and the last part. Oh, I just got out of search too. That's why my kill streaks are so low. I would have had them higher. But then I like how this game was mostly shotgun kills. But anyways, see you later, guys. Oh yeah, and don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you really enjoyed it. Dude, that looks awesome with that. I know it's only on the butt side.